I'd say that was probably the best place you could learn how to snowboard or ski. Oh, it was great, in all honesty. I mean, there was all these some characters out there that everyone knew. Today, mid-Michigan skiers and snowboarders are left reminiscing about the slopes they once traversed at Apple Mountain. After a statement posted on the resort's website announced that following careful consideration, the slopes at Apple Mountain will remain closed for the foreseeable future. Despite our best efforts, we acknowledge that we cannot sustain our snow sports operations in the current environment. And snowboarders like Garrett Zimistrad, who grew up on the incline, say its loss will be felt by all in mid-Michigan. Just because it's so close, I mean, the closest hill besides Apple Mountain is, you know, an hour away, so it's really easy to shoot over there after work. Others, like Chris Lang, who used to work at Apple Mountain before coming to the stable ski and bike shop in Saginaw, say it was only a matter of time due to the unreasonably warm weather shutting down the slopes last year and the need for more repairs on its underground piping system. But with the first snowfall of 2018 finally here, even he still had some hope. And that's what we thought was going to happen. But, uh, I mean, they do have the snowmaking equipment, so um, hopefully they'll turn them back on and, you know, get people out there again. But despite the slopes not being open this year, the rest of the resort will still be open to residents. In Freeland, Jonathan Jackson, WNEM-TV5.